8th grade channel. I am Aishwarya, your biology teacher. I am Arsh, your maths educator. And welcome to yet another amazing edition of Unit Test League 2.0 where we have the challenge series ma'am. Yes. Today it's going to be bio versus maths, no? Yes, and we'll <laughs> see who is going to win. So first, team up, kids. कौन बच्चे कौन सी टीम में वैसे ऐसे करना नहीं चाहिए। Yeah, you should know maths and bio equally well, but it's okay. We, you know how the challenge series has been going on, and of course, as you know, it's on your very favorite, very own Menti platform. So everybody, quickly go ahead, go to menti.com, and you will be able to join. So you will be able to see the code. All right, are you all able to see the code? Okay, just give me a moment. Yes, all right. I will tell you the code very quickly. So, ma'am, can you pass me a piece of paper? Yeah. So, the Menti code is 13955705. So, it is 13955705 is your Menti code. Go to www.menti.com and enter this code quickly. Yes, and I want to write it on screen so that you will be able to see it. So in the meanwhile, as we get ready, so one, three, nine, double, five. Then we have seven zero. I think I missed the last one. Seven zero five. Yes. So this is the Menti code, everyone. Quickly. Yes. In the team of misleading. Misleading. Hmm. I also heard a small rumor. I also heard from some other classes that you like having Ashwara ma'am. You know, compete against Ashwara ma'am during these menti wars. I heard a rumor, all of you. Did I hear it right? Yes? Please, no slow mode today. No, no, we will not have slow mode. But everyone quickly join on menti. Are you able to join on menti? Everyone quickly, www.menti.com and the code is what I have written on screen. So ma'am, how... How is it going to be today? What do you think? How they're going to fare in today's challenge? I think, look, today's challenge is going to be fun, okay? So, biology and maths, I don't have bio. It happens most of the times, right? Like when you're already feeling confident with math, bio is a scary subject. And when you're feeling confident with biology, maths is a scary subject. Throughout school, math was very scary for me. Okay, and in the 11th class, you have to like choose between yeah. maths and bio, so that's become a thing. Okay, so kids, you join a quiz quickly and tell us what you think today is going to happen. So, maths versus bio, bio will win, maths will win. Look, you have to score in the two subjects. So ultimately, whatever you score marks, we will add you to the final leaderboard, so we will get together. We don't have to do that if you win the bio, then you have to win the math, or if you win the math, then you have to win the bio. Ultimately, your marks are low, okay? We don't have to do that. Yes? Good evening everybody, good evening. Yes, and everyone, very quickly, please make sure that you like this video, you share this video with your friends and say, stay subscribed. And Krishnendu, I'm very sorry if you were feeling a little overwhelmed after the previous session. But don't worry, after today's class, Arsh ma'am and I will lift your spirits up. So bring all that energy and enthu, right? And everybody, quickly, let's have a tar like target of at least 100 likes on this video. So make sure that you go ahead and share this video and, st uh, you know, we'll start, make sure that you like this video, right? Right? Yes, and those who have joined the Menti quiz, do let us know in the comment section. And tell us which emojis are coming. How are you joining emojis? Tell us, we will find you. We'll find you. Yes. Right, right. So as, as of now, uh, ma'am, that rumor is correct. Yeah, yeah, I know. I hear things. I'm everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> so, but before we get started, Jessima, how many do we have in our class? 81. I can see 81 of you are here, so minimum. Base, base minimum, we should ah, have 100, 100 likes. 100 likes, yes. Yes. So the code is on screen. We're just here for some more time so that you, you know, make sure that you get the code. But everyone quickly in the meanwhile, as you all join, make sure that you all try out the spoken English classes. So I'm spoken English is a very, very important mm -hmm. course for our students because yes. some of them struggle with English or sometimes they feel very conscious about English. But there's a two month confidence speaking program that will definitely help you. And we have Cambridge certified teachers wherein they will be teaching you at your own space. Right, yes. ma'am? Now, you will get a safe space here. Nobody is going to judge you. Okay, you will say English, you will improve. And you will feel the change. 
ठीक है वंस यू आर आउट ऑफ दिस प्रोग्राम आपको लगेगा कि आपने बहुत गेन किया है एंड आई थिंक जो स्टूडेंट्स जिन्होंने ये प्रोग्राम yes. देख लिया है एंड दे आर सेइंग कि बहुत बेनिफिट हुआ उनको यस सो यू कैन ट्राई इट आउट यू विल फाइंड द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स को चेक इट आउट वेबसाइट पे देखो क्या कुछ आपको मिलेगा इस प्रोग्राम में एंड यू कैन ट्राई इट यस यस सो ऑफ कोर्स एवरीवन क्विकली But before we get started, this is a very important slide, right, ma'am? Because we have the unit test league going on, yes. and of course, we are going to be monitoring all of your scores. And the top three, the top three winners who've been regular to our classes and who have stayed subscribed, you stand a chance to win a digital certificate signed by all of us. So everybody, please make sure that you do fill in your details. Now, see. I can see a good amount of you on the live, but I can see only twenty-five of you are here. So, ma'am, I think we can give our students some time. Some time, yes. Quickly join in and even call out your friends. कि आजाओ फटाफट से साथ में करते हैं, साथ में ये challenge में participate करते हैं. और भी मजा आएगा जब आपके दोस्त भी इस challenge में included होंगे. ठीक है? तो फटाफट से give them a quick call. आजाओ, आजाओ. सबको बुला लो. Yes, quickly. And no maths में don't do tukka. Maths में have your notebooks and pens. See, yeah. whenever you have maths ka class, right? Always, right? I think, ma'am, this is something that you also tell yes, them, no, to have yes. their notebooks and pens. हवा में कुछ नहीं करना है, ठीक है? You should be ready with your notebooks and pen. उसके अलावा बेटा question में गलती करोगे, silly mistake करोगे, फिर बोलोगे misclick हो गया. That will create problem और आपके score जो है नीचे चला जाएगा. Yes, वो नहीं करेंगे हम. अच्छे से आज हर एक question को read करके उसको solve करेंगे. Yes, बच्चा? Um, okay. Ma'am, when are results of UTL soon? Har Simran soon and Krishna Hindu. It's okay. See, in the previous session, the live chat was moving so fast. It's it's a miracle that Saurabh sir and I saw the comments that were there also because you know us. We also have Chashma. We're a little bit poor eyesight. Also, we have. He was also telling us to go to the doctor very recently. So there are like some you you know us. We're aging. Don't take it too hard. Okay. <laughs> Okay, ताकि आप गलत स्कोर करो मतलब गलत आंसर पे क्लिक करो और आपका स्कोर नीचे 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 आ जाए तो चार्ट में भरोसा नहीं करना है सोल्व द क्वेश्चन योर सेल्फ एंड देन टेक द राइट आंसर ओके यस And I think, ma'am, there are a lot of students who are very new to our class and meeting us for the first time. Yes. So for those of you who are very new and probably stumbled upon this video, maybe because your friends told you, I'm Aishwarya and I mainly teach you biology and I also help you out with SST. And Arsh, ma'am, here is our maths rock star. Who's here? <laughs> so so I I also teach you on ninth and tenth channel. And here we also teach maths. So make sure you make sure you subscribe to the channel. Explore the channel once. You will find all the useful. Important sessions that you need, right? So make sure go through all the uh, videos and then subscribe the channel. Also hit the uh, bell icon so that you notification yes. miss na kare. Live session me timely aaye karo, bahut fayda hoga. ठीक है? Okay, so I can see good number of you are here already. So Princey, we have already started the session. It's happening on menti. dot com. So quickly go there. Ma'am, can grade nine attend? Yeah, yeah. All of you attend. Nothing like that. Grade nine for you it will be revision, right? Yeah. Okay, so so let me see how many likes we got. Yes, Arshma is checking. So I really hope we've hit hundred likes. Have we hit hundred likes? No, Jaisa Ma sir is like no. <laughs> Quickly, let's make it hundred. Yes, कितना कितना मुश्किल है बताओ मुझे. How many are we at Jaisa Ma? So we are at seventy eight. Seventy six. Yeah. Everyone else. चलो twenty five more likes and then we will start the session. So quickly like the video. So that we could start with our menti quiz, na? Challenge start करते हैं बच्चा. किसकी wait हो रही है? जल्दी जल्दी से आपकी wait हो रही है to like the video. Quickly do that. Yes. And quickly, if you're if you're attending this menti challenge for the first time, so I will tell you one thing, right? There are going to be six questions, total of twelve. Six from maths, six from biology, and based on the number of students who answer it correctly, that is the points that is going to go into the board, the leaderboard. Yes. 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 So you can see the leaderboard here. That's what's going to come. And at the end of it, the total number is what is going to decide who is who. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Only eighty-five. Bacha, how can we hit hundred? That and all is possible. Ninety likes, ninety watching. Okay. Yes, you have to answer fast. So, ma'am, I think we can get started. Yeah, no? let's get started. So, by the end of the very first question, let's complete our target itself. Okay. Yes. So let's okay. see question number one of twelve. 
so many emojis. Yes. Now they'll ask us. <laughs> Please don't answer. Haan, I know this. Every time I come with either Arsh ma'am or Saurav sir, this is one comment I get. You know me. You know my Hindi is. It's not very great. Very teda meda types. Very broken Hindi. So I'll speak in English. इतना परेशान क्यों करते हो आप मैम को हाँ? They like doing that. <laughs> okay. So, so ma'am, I think we can get started. Yeah. Let's move to the very first question. So here comes your question number one on your screens. Maths का सवाल आ चुका है. ध्यान से read the question and then try to answer. Okay. Multiplication of a non-zero rational number and its reciprocal is. It's a very easy question. Read the statement or quickly answer it. Okay. काफी ज़्यादा time मिल गया इस question के लिए. Yes. So multiplication of a non-zero rational number and its reciprocal. Easy peasy. Okay, Lakvinder is flawed. All right. You have lots of time. So much time. Bio may only get half this time. <laughs> Okay, so last last twenty seconds are left. Quickly answer yes. Hey, Princey, done. I think everybody is done. और इसको गलत मत करना. गलत करने वाला सवाल ही नहीं है ये. बहुत ही आसान सवाल है. Okay, so last five seconds, बच्चा. Last five seconds. Three, two, one, and your time's up. Let's see. Okay, so 69 students have given the right answer. Well done, बच्चे. तो क्या बोला था? Rational number और उसका reciprocal. Let's take one example. चलो p by q एक rational number है. Yes, p by q की form में लिख रहे हैं and q is not equal to zero. It's a rational number. Yes. और non-zero है, ठीक है? Zero नहीं है क्योंकि ये. अच्छा इसका अगर हम reciprocal कर देंगे तो we'll get q upon p. उल्टा हो जाएगा. दोनों को multiply करोगे. P भी cancel out हो जाएगा. Q भी cancel out हो जाएगा. So you will get one, you will always get one, right? So that was our very first question. और हमारा score कितना हो गया maths में 69. So इसी तरीके से आपके score calculate होंगे जितने बच्चों ने सही answer दिया, तो उतने marks हमारे add होते जाएंगे यहाँ पे counters में. ठीक है? You can see the counters here. Yes. So well done everybody. Lot of you misleading in the chat. Everyone see. When you're done with the answer, just reply done. Okay. So once you're done answering on menti, you reply done. Okay, it came out, I am done answering. Very good. Very yes. simple and easy one. And so, I can see, बहुत सारे बच्चे गलत आंसर दे रहे हैं चैट में. वो मत करो. चैट में मत देखो. पहले खुद कैलकुलेट करो. फिर आंसर दो. ठीक है? Yes. And Krishnendu, no, no, don't post any comment. It's okay. You play the game. You be part of now what's happening, right? Very interesting challenge is happening. So you stay in the now. You're going to have a lot of fun today. So shall we move on to the next question? Yes. Are we ready for question number two? Quickly. Need more Josh in the chat, right? More energy, more enthusiasm. We need it. Chalo, chalo, chalo. Quickly. Now it's time for bio question. Okay. Let's see the question. It's going to be a very easy one. I'm assuming. Okay. So everyone, this is the question that is there. So assertion reason. All right. So we have an assertion reason question where before storing the grains, the harvested grains are dried in the sun. Reason being, if freshly harvested grains are stored without drying, they may get spoiled or attacked by organisms, making them unfit. All right, so let's have a look. Oops, something happened here. Can we go back? So, yes. Sorry about that. There was some issue. Yeah. Anyway, same thing. Assertion is before storing harvested grains are dried in the sun. Reason being that if they are freshly harvested grains, they are stored without drying, they may get spoiled or attacked. Very easy. You don't need, you don't need me only. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> Mom, I think you can uh, operate it from there. Okay. Huh? Yeah. Done, 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 done. Yes, very good. I like how you're not misleading anymore. Maths may also you should do this, okay? Don't give wrong answers after solving. Now I can also see some answers coming in, some wrong answers. Yes. I know, it saved that time because I showed you the question. But this art kiss do like the uh, hit, hit the like button. <laughs> like it, Kurdo, but I'd say. Very good everybody, very good. 83 of you have got the correct answer. Well, so this is a very easy, right? I mean, if you go to the next one, oops. <laughs> okay, wait, we have to go back again. Yeah, 
See, assertion statement was what is it? Assertion statement says that before storing grains, before storing, harvested grains are dried in the sun. So we know that drying is a very important process for storing of grains. Now reason is telling that if freshly harvested grains are stored without drying, where there is a good amount of moisture content, it can get spoiled by the growth of microorganisms or it can get, you know, damaged by maybe some other pests, thereby making them unfit for use. Which is why the assertion statement is true and the reason is true and reason is correct uh, you explanation it is a the reason is a correct reason for the assertion statement okay so that is something that you need to know all right okay so now let's move on to the next one so let's have the score we see that after round one woo. Mm, so bio is winning with 83 points and maths ke 69 points so with the next question we have to cover up okay chalo 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 jaldi se get ready with your notebooks yes Yes. Kya hum agle question pe bade? Chalo. It's time for your question number three. And here comes your question. Dhyan se bade ke answer dena naak nahi katwani hai. Thik hai? Chalo, chalo. Quickly. Okay. So, area of a trapezium is 34 square centimeters. The length of one of the parallel sides is 10 centimeters. Also, the height is given as 4 centimeters. You have to find the length of the other parallel side. So this is a formula based question. I hope you know what is the, uh, how do we calculate the area of uh, this trapezium. Yes, quickly. And no, like ma'am said, don't do mental math. Hmm. Solve it. Yes. Pick out, uh, jaldi se take out your pen, pencil, jo bhi hai, likh ke isko solve karo. Aapke paas area de rakh hai. Length of one parallel side is given, height is given to you. You have, you have to find the length of the other parallel side. Chalo, chalo, bohat easy calculation hai, kuch mushkil nahi hai. Jaldi se answer nikalo, yes. Okay, yes, chat is misleading. Don't trust the chat. Trust your answer. Why are you misleading? I'm okay. very curious to know that. <laughs> they want to come on the leaderboard. So, what will happen? 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 What will so, let's understand how to do the question. I'll tell you here only. So, here we see what the area of parallelogram is. Area is equal to half into sum of parallel sides. So, I have to write L1, length 1, L2, length 2, length 3, length 4, length 5, length 6, length 7, length 8, length 9, length 10, length 11, length 12, length 13, length 14, length 15, length 16, length 17, length 18, length 19, length 20, length 21, length 22, length 23, length 24, length 25, length 26, length 27, length 28, length 29, length 30, length 31, length 32, length 33, length 34, length 35, length 36, length 37, length 38, length 39, length 40, length 41, length 42, length 10 centimeters. L2 ko aise le lete hain. This we have to find. Height of, uh, height is given as 4. To ye kya ban gaya? So this becomes 17 equals to 10 plus L2. To L2 ka value aa jayega 7 centimeters. So 7 centimeters is the right answer. Thik hai? Chalo. Very good. Now it's time for your bio question. Aur yes. Aur iske baad... आपको six questions के बाद leaderboard दिखाया हाँ. जाएगा, ठीक है? So buckle up, चलिए. Let's have a look. All right. Yes. So I think some of you have just joined. The code is there on top. It is thirteen ninety five fifty seven zero five. Others help them out, right? Menti code. I think uh, Parvati has sent it to you. You can take it from the chat. Okay. No problem if it's Mr. Centipede, no problem at all. Question number four, everybody, quickly on your screens. Easy peasy bio question. To which category do the following microorganisms belong to? Super easy. Amoeba, Chlamydomonas, Penicillium. Now you need to figure out. So Amoeba is A, Chlamydomonas is B, Penicillin is, Penicillium is C. Now based on that you need to identify which is correctly matched. See timing is everything here. Okay. Don't get confused. This is from chapter microorganisms. And on an examination from this chapter is very very important. Also, those who have already answered the question, hit the like button. Chalo. Yes. Quickly everyone, 10 more seconds and you'll be done. And lot of misleading answers on the chat. Guys, maths is friend or foe. <laughs> this chapter's name is microorganisms friend or foe. <laughs> Guys. What happened? 
I can see that 47 of you have got this right. Okay. Some of you have gotten confused with option D, which says bacteria, fungi, and protozoa. Okay. See, now the thing is, if you look at this, right, I do have another slide, but nonetheless, if you see, what is amoeba? Amoeba is a unicellular eukaryotic organism. That means, what is your amoeba? Amoeba is nothing but your protozoa, right, or it is a protozoan. What is chlamydomonas? Most of you get confused here. Chlamydomonas is actually algae, right, it's a kind of unicellular algae that is there, yes? So, see... Amoeba ka, it's a little tricky. I mean, Chlamydomonas ka, I know it becomes a little tricky. Yes, but Penicillium, as we know, is fungi, right? Which is why in this case, so if we go ahead and see the organisms, yes? So if we go ahead and see the organisms, okay, why is this happening today? Ha, okay. So anyway, when you have a look at these organisms, we see that the correct answer is option B. For others who made a mistake here, are we clear? Yes. Now, for those of you who made exact, yes, Arsimran, I have almost been singing it like a song. <laughs> That's how much I've been talking about microorganisms and you know I love teaching it. But amoeba is protozoan, clamidomonas is kind of algae, right? And of course, penicillium is a fungi, penicillium. So now moving on to question number five, everybody. So we have the score, ma'am, score has become ah. very close now. Okay, so 130 biology and 125 maths, there's a difference number ka difference, hai bhai. Chalo, ab dekhte hai kya hota hai, thikai, is round mein, chalo. So, ready for the maths question? Yes? Everybody is ready for the next question, question number 5. So, ye aagya aapki screen ke upar. Okay, so the question says, if the lateral surface area of a cube is 100 centimeter square, then the volume is, very easy question again. Mensuration chapter ka ye sawal hai. You know what is the lateral surface area of a cube? Matlab, aas paas ki divaron ka area. Thik hai? Yes, left, right, front and back. So that is your lateral surface area. Kaise calculate karte hai? Formula bhi hota hai, waise bhi aap nikal sakte ho. Thik hai? Woh aapke paas already de rakha hai. And then, you have to find the volume. So ma'am, if I am right, there are two steps to this, right? Yes. There is one very important step that you have to deduce. Yes. And then use that and find the volume. Yes. I feel very proud. <laughs> and I got this. <laughs> Achha, chalo, 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 quickly. Yes, aage answer. You have only 12 seconds left. Itna mushkil nahi hai. Calculation bhoat easy hai yaar. Bhoat easy calculation hai. Chalo. Okay. All right, so we have 47 students who have given the answer. Diya hai. Well done, well done. So simple sa formula is the lateral surface area. What is the formula? That is 4 into side square. Look, what will be the area of the wall? Side into side. Side ko A is a square, the A square 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 is a square. So there are 4 walls. Na? So 4 A square is the Lateral surface area, right? So lateral surface area, you have already 100. So here, how much A square value will come from? That will be 25. So A value will come from 5. Our pass, yes. So 5 units will come from volume. Nikal na, volume is equal to side cube. So 5 cube is 125 centimeter cube is your right answer. Miss click kar diya. Are, are, are. Koi baat nahi. Chalo, it's okay. Next question se, dhyan se answer dena hai. Chik hai? Make sure you are writing, writing all the steps. Hawa mein mat karo. Yes. Miss click kar diya, koi baat hi, ye hota rehta. Choti choti galtiyan hoti rehti, it's okay. And Bye also ma'am, another thing is, if you don't do that 25 to 5 step, then your whole answer can go wrong again yes. to 625. Exactly. Some of them were saying that as well. So guys. To A square nahi dekha hai. Yeah. So, if you silly mistakes, so check out that whatever you are doing, whatever you are doing, whatever you are doing, next time we will not do that. Let's check the math. Let's check the score. First, the bio question, then we will check the score. Yes. Actually, can we have the score, Jessima, before this? We'll have a quick look. Okay. 130, 172. Okay. Now, so we need 42 people to answer so that we'll be tied up with math. So, let's see. I'm sure that this is going to be a very interesting question and hopefully let's see what we have in store. So Mama, can we have the question? Yes. All right. Which of the following is a mismatched pair? Let's see the options. 
adrenal pituitary gland, estrogen, ovary, pancreas, insulin, testosterone, testis. See, we have done this chapter very recently, right? I think on Monday we did the chapter, Tuesday we have the doubt solving, today we are having it. It's going to be very simple. We are talking about which is a mismatched pair. Now you see here, right? There is hormone and gland. This is all that I am telling. Wow. Very good everyone, very good. Most of you have got this right, 60 of you have got this right. So we know that adrenaline is a hormone that is produced by the adrenal gland which is located on top of the kidneys, right? And there are a pair of adrenal glands. And adrenaline I told you is also known as the emergency hormone or the stress hormone which is normally produced during a fight or flight response. And that's what increases our heart rate and we know that that is what in, you know increases our breathing rate. But at the same time pituitary gland is a master gland which produces stimulating hormones, growth hormones and we know growth hormone is responsible for you know growth spurt, elongation and height and other stimulating hormones control the functioning. While on the other hand estrogen and ovary are marked correctly because ovary produces estrogen, insulin is produced by the pancreas and testosterone is produced by the testes. So the correct answer here is option B, I mean option A. So yes this is all about adrenaline and let's have the score please. So yes, bios Yay, now. Nice, well done everyone, well done. But I'm, I'm seeing that it's still not, it's still a close call, right? Huh. It's 190, 172. So very proud of all of you and it's making the game more interesting <laughs> and interesting, I would say. Yes. So ma'am, we'll have a look at the leaderboard. Let's see the leaderboard. Let's see what the leaderboard has to say. So ma'am, you'd like to take it? Okay, so Sharvi, I love bio and maths. Oh, that's great. So Sharvi has given the fastest answer and she is on the top of the leaderboard. On the very second position we have Aditya, then we have Keshav, Hansik, Harsimran, Shivani, Navya, Gurgun, Uvix and Sw Swayamji. Well done guys. So these are the top 10 students on the leaderboard. And you can see all the confetti for all of you. Look at how good it's made. All right, ma'am, I'm late. Okay, no matter. Sure, you can join the quiz now. You can see on the top here. You can see on the top here. Go to www.menti.com and enter the code one three nine double five seven zero five. Okay. Yes, and thank you, Parvati, for sharing it. I'm very proud of all of you. See, whatever your score is, right? See, irrespective, of course, these are the top top 10 that you see. But nonetheless, whatever your score is, be proud of it and work towards making it better. Yes. So if your score is 50, next aim should be at least, ma'am, I should make it 25, right? So that is what the improvement you should be looking for. And more than, of course, we bring you all of these kind of sessions, but the main intent is what? That you have a revision. When do you get the time to actually revise biology and mathematics together? Huh. Only here. Right? So that is why it is important that you subscribe also and you do not forget to subscribe. Yes? Maths will win for sure. Love the conviction. And that's what we want. Okay. So now, now we have part 2. Shuru ho chuke. So after 6 questions, we will show you the leaderboard, the final leaderboard. Okay? Chalo. Moving on to your question number 7. Again, Maths ka question aega. Get ready. Use your pen, oh, pens or pencils, please. Okay, chalo. And here comes your question number seven. Are iske liye to pen pun ki zarurat hi hai. Discount is always calculated on. Discount kiski upar calculate karte hai hamlo. Cost price ki upar, selling price ki upar, marked price ki upar ya fir none of these. Chalo. Very easy question. Profit ah, and loss, right ma'am? Profit and loss. See, all my school memories are coming rushing to me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Please don't... Haan, don't trust the chart, okay? Give your answers. This is not such a question. Hai. Hai? All right. So we have... Aray, 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 aray. So cost price, but the cost price answer is given. Cost price is given on the price of the shopkeeper. Hai. वो आइटम खरीद के ला रहा है 
सेलिंग प्राइस उस उस शॉपकीपर ने उसका मतलब कई बार कॉस्ट प्राइस हम चेंज कर देते हैं ना डिस्काउंट डिस्काउंट देने के बजाय कॉस्ट मार्क प्राइस इज द वन दैट यू सी ऑन द टैग्स जिसके ऊपर आपको डिस्काउंट मिलता है ठीक है तो डिस्काउंट हमेशा मार्क प्राइस पे मिलता है ना कि जिस जिस प्राइस पे हम चीज को खरीद के लाए ठीक है सो सेलिंग प्राइस तो आपको सबको पता है बेचना दैट इज अ टोटल डिफरेंट थिंग ठीक है तो आंसर इज मार्क प्राइस राइट सो चलो 49 स्टूडेंट्स ने सही आंसर दिया है वेल डन तो ये सेलिंग प्राइस का तो बच्चा ऑप्शन ही नहीं था सेलिंग प्राइस इज जिसपे हम अमाउंट uh, जिसपे हम बेच रहे हैं ठीक है तो वो नहीं हो, वो तो हो ही नहीं सकता यस yes? चलो तो आगे बढ़ते हैं एंड अच्छा ये देखो ये यहां पे भी वही चीज लिखी है ठीक है एक्सपेक्टेड या दर्शन मैंने भी एक्सपेक्ट किया था बट चलो कोई बात ही देर वॉज सम कंफ्यूजन आई होप इट इज क्लियर नाउ ठीक है गलती से हो गया चलो कोई बात नहीं गलती माफ एंड दोज ऑफ यू हैव गॉटन अ लिटिल कंफ्यूज टेक अ स्क्रीनशॉट ऑफ दिस इज ब्यूटीफुली रिटन फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू राइट यू कैन टेक अ स्क्रीनशॉट एंड एट ऑल टाइम्स व्हेनेवर यू गेट कंफ्यूज्ड बिटवीन ऑल ऑफ दीस टर्मिनोलॉजीज यू कैन जस्ट हैव अ लुक एट दिस इट्स ब्यूटीफुली रिटन इन दिस जब भी सेल लगती है आपको पता है 70% 50% वो एक्चुअली में फ्रॉड है एक तरह का <laughs> तो वो क्या करते हैं प्राइस को पहले बढ़ा देते हैं और फिर उस पे डिस्काउंट लगा देते हैं हमें लगता है कि भाई 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 बहुत मजा आ रहा है सेल से लेके आए हैं ये ठीक है तो वो मार्क्ड प्राइस जो है वो जो प्राइस मार्क कर दिया जाता है उसके ऊपर डिस्काउंट लगा के वो आपको चीज बेचते हैं ठीक है यस सो इट इज ऑलवेज कैलकुलेटेड ऑन मार्क्ड प्राइस ओके चलो सो नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड फॉर द बायो क्वेश्चन एवरीवन क्वेश्चन नंबर एट ऑन योर स्क्रीन सुपर डुपर इजी क्वेश्चन विल बी कमिंग एंड लेट्स हैव अ लुक आई एम अज्यूमिंग इट सुपर डुपर इजी इन हाइड्रा यस इट इज The mode of reproduction is what? I am not even reading the options. All of you who is there today should be able to answer this. Okay, this is from reproduction in animals. Like in Kriti Ma'am's language, masoom sa question, right? Halwa <laughs> question. Asexual, sexual, both A and B, or is it? It none of these. See, I can see around hundred students at least. I need hundred of you. I am assuming some might do misclick, right? I'm assuming at least ninety will get this. Wow! Very good. <laughs> yes, this is Gajar ka halwa only. No, very easy question this is, because you know, right? What is Hydra? It is a multicellular organism, right? But at the same time, it's a very simple-bodied organism, and we know that primarily it reproduces by asexual mode of reproduction. Before I go ahead quickly, what is the mode of reproduction we see in Hydra? What mode of asexual reproduction? Can you tell me what mode? Yes, I'm seeing the answers. I want everybody to give me the answer. Very good. We observe budding in Hydra, right? What is budding? It is the outgrowth. Yes. So we see that there's a small outgrowth or a protrusion, and eventually, in the case of Hydra, the protrusion, the bud will develop, undergo maturation. Then it will develop tentacles, and of course, it will detach from the parent, and it will become a new organism. So that is what we mean by it. Very easy question. So let's have a look at the leaderboard, everyone. Ah, yes, this is. Yes, I've already told you this. It's okay. Woo! Okay, so score. Okay, so we have two seventy two. Two seventy two for bio. But now time, see what happened. Now you're just slip off tongue. So two seventy two for bio and two twenty one for maths. Very good. So bio, you're very far ahead. ठीक है अब कवर अप करने के लिए बहुत ही धमाकेदार आपको मेहनत करनी पड़ेगी यस ओके ओके सो लेट्स सी क्या करते हो आप अगले सवाल में बट बिफोर दैट Of course, everyone. I'm sure all of you would have heard about the live quizzes that's happening on the Byju's app, right? And if you guys have not downloaded the Byju's app yet, right? Please make sure that you go and download it. The Byju's app will be especially in your phones. Download it on the phone. And trust me, at 7 p.m. normally for about 15 to 20 minutes, we have a live quiz where we come up with some interesting topics. Again, helping you out with your GK. Yes, Darshan is like, ma'am, I missed it today. It's okay. How many of you were there yesterday? Today, I was uh, I was taking the quiz there as well, and soon you will find all of us also taking a quiz. For premium members, also see if you have the app version, you will be able to watch it, right? So premium, you will be have you will have to download it on the phone and then make sure that you try it out. Yes, ha, Kita was there yesterday. Amazing. 
All right, everyone. So live quizzes very soon. So download the app. Very very important. Mom is going to be exciting, right? Ha, it's going to be very exciting because topics are very amazing, hai bhai. Topics are very different. Different. We are going to take. Okay. And you are going to compete like Pan India, like all yes. over India. Kids are participating in this uh, quiz. Ke andar. 15 minutes. Ka chotu sa quiz hai. Fun quiz hai. So make sure you participate. Free hai ekdam. Just uh, download the Byju's Learning app. You will find the link in the description and go forward with it. Okay. And quickly to take your question, RP Gamer. The thing is, when you download the app, right, and you are able to, when you once you register, if you are a premium member, you will already be registered. But once you register, what will happen is on top in your home page only you will find a notification which says, right, that it is going to be on um, this part today. This particular quiz is there along with the scheduler at the bottom which says what else is there, right? So. Just download the app. It's very user friendly. You will be able to figure out what is what. Okay. So now let's move on to the next question. Jaldi, jaldi. Okay. So question number nine coming on your screens. Are you guys ready? Get ready, bacha. Chalo, chalo, chalo. Get ready for your question number nine. And here comes your question. Cube of a negative number is Dash number. Is it a negative number, positive number, negative or positive? Kuch bhi ho sakta hai ya fir none of these. Very easy question. Negative number ka cube kya hoga? For example, agar minus 2 hai, minus 2 ka cube kya hoga? Minus 3 ka cube kya hoga? Koi bhi negative number le lo, you just have to tell me. Cube of a negative number is. Ma'am, horrible misclick. <laughs> this is a very easy question, but I am expecting... At least okay. Oh. Okay, chalo. Well done, well done. And I can see कुछ बच्चों ने अभी भी दस बच्चों ने गलती कर दी है. I'm assuming कि ये misclick हुआ है क्योंकि ये वाले question में गलती नहीं हो सकती. Why? Because देखो किसी भी negative number का अगर cube करते हो, तो देखो अगर minus two है, तो minus two का cube क्या होगा? Minus two into minus two into minus two, right? तो minus minus तो plus हो जाएगा. And plus minus क्या होता है? Minus. So ultimately you will be getting a negative number. ठीक है? अगर यहाँ पे पूछा जाता नेगेटिव नंबर का स्क्वायर क्या होता है, so it is going to be positive, but क्यूब हमेशा क्या होगा नेगेटिव होगा, ठीक है? Yes, तो आप ऐसे भी देख सकते हो अगर पावर इवन है, तो it becomes positive, अगर पावर ऑड हो जाती है, तो it becomes नेगेटिव, ठीक है? चलो जी, so now कितना स्कोर हो गया हमारा मैच में? इसके बाद बायो का क्वेश्चन आएगा, इस राउंड में फिर चेक करते Yes, so it's 308 for maths and 272. Yes, let's move further. For all of them saying, ma'am, say hi to me. Hi to all of you from both of our sides, okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. Question number 10 on your screens right now. The cell formed after... I don't even want to finish. <laughs> Such an easy question. Cell formed after fertilization is called what? Fetus, zygote, embryo, none of these. Guys, chances of mistakes are there. But if you have paid attention in the reproduction in animals class which Ankita ma'am took, I am sure that you will be able to answer. Ma'am, Krishnendu has a question in maths. Okay, let me see. Yes. Can we scroll up a little? Uh, Jaisima, just one comment. Ha, I think it's there now. Down only it's there. Okay, we're not able to. Okay, just Okay. Wait. So... Math and bio both easy. हाँ, पूरा एकदम neck to neck competition चल रहा है. Okay, wow. Very good everybody, very good. I'm so proud that you all paid attention in class and didn't get confused, right? So as you know, right, zygote is a form cell, a single cell which is formed after the fusion of male and female gamete. Your zygote will undergo development to form embryo. Embryo will further under uh, will further undergo development to give you fetus, right? So correct answer is zygote. Okay, so Krishnedu is asking whether the square of a negative number is positive. Obviously, bacha, ab jab ab negative number ka square karte ho. Let's take for an example minus two ही ले लो, ठीक है? तो minus two का square में मतलब minus two into minus two, right? और minus minus क्या होता है? Plus होता है, so square of a negative number बच्चे is always going to be positive. Is it clear now? Yes. Cube of a negative number will be negative, क्योंकि 
थ्री टाइम्स जो है वो आपका नेगेटिव साइन मल्टीप्लाई होगा तो माइनस माइनस प्लस बन जाएगा अभी स्टिल वन नेगेटिव साइन इज पेंडिंग देयर है ना सो प्लस माइनस इज माइनस सो दंसर विल बी नेगेटिव ओके जस्ट एक्सपैंड द स्क्वायर और एक्सपैंड द क्यूब यू विल अंडरस्टैंड कि क्यूब पॉजिटिव या फिर नेगेटिव बन रहा है ठीक है चलिए यस सो आफ्टर दिस Laugh before the last two questions, right? We have bio at three fifty eight and math at three hundred and eight. Okay. Well, so now we're going to see the final scores maybe after the twelfth question, right, yes. ma'am? So, Jaisa ma, we can update the scores and keep, but we'll show it after the twelfth one. Okay. So now, quickly moving on to the last two questions. Yes, you know this. Okay. So, question number eleven. Jaldi se ready ho jao. Here comes your question number 11 maths ka sawal aa chuka hai aapki screen pe name the pyramid shown in the given figure please dhyan se sides ko dhyan se dekho count very carefully okay kitni sides hai aur us hisab se answer dena i am also counting with you <laughs> is it a nonagonal is it a octagonal decagonal or hexagonal pyramid dhyan se count karo <laughs> Ashwarya ma'am got it right. <laughs> you can put one point extra for maths. You buy count. My marks are also there. <laughs> okay. ध्यान से count करो. पीछे वाली sides को भूलना नहीं है. See, counting mistake is one hundred percent possible in this. हाँ. Okay. चलो फिर भी मैक्सिमम स्टूडेंट्स ने सही आंसर दिया वेरी गुड 64 स्टूडेंट्स हैव गिवन द राइट आंसर वेल डन सो हाउ मेनी साइड्स आर देयर देयर आर एट साइड्स देखो एट ट्रायंगल्स बन रहे हैं ऊपर की तरफ 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 एंड 8 ठीक है और तो क्या बन जाएगा 8 का मतलब होता है ऑक्टा सो इट इज गोइंग टू बी ऑक्टागोनल पिरामिड यस चलो Har Simran, I'll take your question. Shall I answer your question after the last one? After the bio question, I'll give you a quick answer. Okay. What is the diploid cell? I'll remember that. So, question number twelve, everyone. Last question for today's challenge session that we have. So, let's have a look. Question number twelve on your screens. Identify the following organism and choose the category where it fits. So, you have an image of a bird. Ma'am, options are not visible. It'll come now. If this bird is extinct, this bird is endangered. This bird is migratory, or it is vulnerable. Little tricky, okay. Little tricky. Think and answer. Ma'am, pata nahi. It's okay. Take a guess. Can you scroll down, ma'am? Its name. If I tell you the name, you will know the answer. <laughs> Then you will tell me, ma'am. You leak the paper all the time. <laughs> you will tell me both. <laughs> Leakosaurus. Yes. <laughs> Started with me only. <laughs> If you don't know, take a guess. Mom, I didn't know about the bird, but I guess. Okay. Very good. Very good. It's a crane, right? So these are migratory birds, basically, right? Yes, it's a Siberian crane. So, ma'am, if you could go to the next slide, we can see that this is the Siberian crane. Image is little blur, but normally they are known for their migratory patterns. They're not extinct. They're not endangered, but per se, they are migratory. Now, Har Simran, to answer your question on what is haploid and diploid, right? So, when you talk about haploid, haploid is what? So, we've learned about how in the human body. Wait, one second. Yeah, we've learned about how in the human body we have 46 chromosomes, right? Most cells of the body. But in gametes, there are 23 chromosomes. Now, this 46 is also known as 23 pairs. Yes, we also call it this way. Now this condition where they are in the pair form, we call it as a diploid cell. So they have both diploid. That means two. That means they have both the pairs, right? But here, when you say twenty-three, it is not twenty-three pairs, but they are twenty-three in number, which means that this is haploid. So are we clear with what is diploid and haploid? Are we clear with this? Yes. Are we clear? Can you give me a thumbs up so that I can get moving to the leaderboard? Yes, ma'am. Hindi me padao. Ha ha. It's okay. All right. So let's have a look at the final leaderboard, and let's see who has won today. 
it is Sharvi, I love Bio and Maths, where with 11,422 points. Then we have Navya, who's the fastest, Keshav. Then I can see Aditya, Hanse, Harsadran, Shana. Then I think, uh, are you able to read this? I think it's Parvati. Yes, I think it's Parvati. Yeah, our heads got cut in between, but it's okay. Uvix and Swayam Jit. Well done, everybody. Well done. Ma'am, so are we ready to see the final marks? Yes. Okay, let's check the final score over here. So, okay. So, biology is the winner today. Well done, guys. So, biology has 440 points and with maths, 372 points. So, we've got the board. Very good, everyone. Congratulations. Those who have participated, well done. Participate karna important. Yes, and everybody, I hope all of you have remembered what was your score in the previous leaderboard to now. And I know that a lot of you have done really well, right? So very proud of all of you who are part of today's class. I hope all of you have liked this video. Snowfall is happening. Yes. Now we have snowfall also. <laughs> So of course everybody with this you know right why you need to stay subscribed to the channel because we have very important playlists right so we have all the necessary one shots ncrt exercise and ma'am we're going to be coming up with more and more interesting classes yes, for them right yes of course and we are planning something big for you Okay, now your holiday season starts, so we also have a lot of good plans. Yes, so do not miss, okay, do not miss to uh, stay subscribed, turn on the bell notification because as you know, the, when it's the holiday season, we also celebrate your our holiday season with you. Yes. Okay, Mahi, what happens if there's deficiency of vitamin K, it affects blood clotting because for blood clotting, vitamin K is very essential, okay? Yes. And of course, everybody, with this, we've got you covered no matter what. And if you love us, if you love what we do, then please make sure that you like this video, right? So make sure that you do like the video, you share this video with your friends. And of course, my very important thing, like we always tell yeah. them, is to subscribe. Subscribe, yes. All right, so that was all for today. Thank you so much for watching this session and coming live here. And we will be seeing you in the next sessions now. Yes. Alright, bye bye, take care everybody yes. and keep learning and keep exploring with Baijus. Yes, lots of love everyone, bye bye.